on the way. And Harris got her swinging. The player with eight home runs already rips this one past a diving Riley Sark. And a long single down the left field line. First three ball count for McBride and tagging that one in the left center. See ya! Kendall Beach continues. Already top 10 in Auburn program history for home runs for her career and that's another one. But when I think about a quality of that, it's a high pitch count. As Alyssa Rivera hits it right back to McBride, she had to shield herself a little bit in the board. And now Snow, who has 26 RBI, drives in another run. That one bounces off the right field wall. Rivera touches home plate. The crowd is ignited. 3-1 on it. With Justice Perry, the three-run shot out of the park last night against Caleb Pointer to put Auburn up four by four. And this one, she puts it into play, tries to be backhanded by Ashlyn Walls. Everybody is safe. And another run comes across for the Tigers. With a five, one lead over Texas A&M in game two of this series. That one gets past Lee, the toss at the plate and safe. Sliding underneath is Justice Perry. You can't learn how to grow from it if you don't go through it. So now they've got that under their belt as backing up just goes past the glove of Martinez. Another run scores for Auburn. And they're just continuing to unleash the fury here. And Harris catching Blake and Frisch looking. She struck out six of the last seven batters. She is on a roll. Little dribbler charging in from shortstop. It is Taylor Snow, and that does it. A complete game victory for Chardonnay Harris, picking up her fifth win of the season. More importantly, clinching the series for the 16th ranked Auburn Tigers.